Hey, this is Dev from Bogren Digital, and today we're going to show you how you can keep your drum fills sounding natural when using drum samples. They say the devil's in the details, which is why we like to go the extra mile when blending in sampled drums with a natural performance. One notably noble technique is to slightly drop the volume of your drum samples during fills using automation. Especially if the fill is fast, by ducking the volume of the drum samples slightly, we make way for the natural drums to come through in all their expressive glory. The idea here is that we don't want to overpower our real drum performance, which should result in a more natural sounding fill. Let's have a listen. Okay, so here's a quick demonstration on automating drum fills in Reaper. Um, Right here I've got a working mix, and um, what I've done is taken all of my drum trigger tracks and I have routed them up to something called a VCA, which is a controller that's going to allow me to automate the volume of all of the tracks that I've sent to it. At its normal volume we've got this. And I'm just going to drop it about one and a half to two dB, maybe. We'll see how something like that sounds. So the difference is subtle, but it just allows those natural drums to shine through a little bit more. And sometimes those subtle details are exactly what we want in a mix. Like all tips discovered on the internet, experiment with it yourself and find out what works best for you. Do our drum samples have you feeling fulfilled? Talk and skull!